hello student this is divyam from code buckets now i am going to start the student dashboard training so students when you get logged in you will just smash smash to a page which is known as video list the first landing page will have the details about the branches the semesters so here we can see the various branches like computer science electrical and triple e double e mechanical civil ece these all branches related to engineering colleges so those students who are in polytechnic and watching this training video don't be afraid once you logged in the subject will be reflected of polytechnic only it's dynamic and it will on login it will uh, just this program this dashboard will get to know that what it have to reflect or what it should not okay so let's see so i am a student whose name is a test student so firstly i will go my profile i will check everything whether everything is uh, is entered about me is correct or not so so i i got uh, here my name is stu test student one my e email uh, is himanshu sharma at the red gmail my father name is father name one my gender is male date of birth so some fields you can see it's not uh, filled as of now and my profile is a 191% completed so how it will become 100% completed so in dob and general category you have to enter your date of birth and gender uh, and your category whatever it could be general sc st obc ebc bc any one of this and you have to confirm it then this will go to your mentor like who is my mentor i can see over here divyam is my mentor so whole data will go to mr divyam my mentor and after once he confirmed this old whole data will be reflected over my profile and my profile will be 100% completed okay but what if i want to change my password because the first password i got it's otp what if if, if i want to update it so for updation the password you can go over and click on update update password and you can go with the new password after just uh, means putting your new password confirming you can update over there and your new password will be ready for this dashboard so again we can go to the landing page which is the which is the video list okay so once we reach on the video list we can see all the branches of the computer science why, uh, all the branches over of the engineering why because in my test two college these all branches are there if in my college uh like if in my college only mechanical and triple will be there then i only can see mechanical and triple e okay so in test college there are all six branches so i can see all the six branches over there in my dashboard so one and most important thing we have kept this whole branches open ended what this means means any student of any branch can go in any branch and see their videos because we know in engineering branch is is not a rigidity like a, a civil engineer uh, can have a good knowledge about data structure he can also very good into the coding or uh, or a computer science engineer can be very good into the microprocessors in microcontrollers in logic design which is the part of electronic communication of engineering so it's vice versa and it's my suggestion in engineering you should not be rigid about your subject you should know every subject because it's every branches are connected with each other in somehow they are connected with in each other in any means so we can see over here like there are subjects uh, branches computer science triple e double e and over here i can see last and this date and time what is this it is actually that what is the latest video updated for this branch this is timing and date of the latest video which has been uploaded by your teacher in this branch maybe that teacher for, uh, belongs from your college or from maybe other college okay great so the structuring you can see the structuring after the branches there is semester so the structuring is replica of your syllabus so that it's become very easy for you at the time of examination or any time if you want to watch any specific topic like uh, you are preparing for your university exam and one night before you want to see the link doubly linked list video so you 
in your syllabus you can find the w linked list is in the semester 4 data structure and under the chapter linked list there is a sub topic known w linked list so how the way you navigate in your syllabus you can navigate here in the website also like in computer science engineer if i am a student of s3 i want to see oops videos object oriented programming videos i selected computer science engineering i have selected s3 over there then i have clicked on proceed after clicking on proceed i can see there is a pcc cs302 object oriented programming using c++ i clicked on it this is the exact replica of your syllabus the see the flow and match it with your syllabus once i clicked on this uh, pcc cs302 means subject code oops i can see the modules in syllabus all in your syllabus also uh, that oops module is split into five parts in the first part i clicked on modules then i can see the chapter the first part the first chapter is introduction to c++ so the flow is the same according to your syllabus so that it will become very easy for you to find any topics and sub topics in in rush time so once I, was, once I clicked on the introduction on c++ i got on proceed once i go there i can see a video of object oriented technology uploaded by dhirendra kumar dc dharbanga you can see views over here views means what this views we have integrated because the student can know that which video is in trending which video is seen by the most of the students of uh, computer science or any other branches in all over engineering colleges of Bihar? Like there are 37 views. Some videos have, have 100 views or 200 views. So there will be a basic comparison. Uh, you can do a basic comparison upon views. That I'm not saying that uh, uh, the views is directly proportional to the quality of teaching. It may not be true. But yeah, it would be a parameter to select good videos. Okay, so um, once I click on this, I can go onto the video. I can find the object oriented uh, heading, description, teacher, duration, and views. If Dhirendra sir of DC Darvanga have uploaded, if he has given any notes or anything, so it sh it would have been reflected over here. Download notes. अगर कोई नोट्स धीरेन्द्र सर इसमें पुटअप करते तो वहां पे आपको एक नोट डाउनलोड करने का ऑप्शन देखता इफ धीरेन्द्र सर पुट अप एनी नोट ओवर देयर यू वुड हैव सीन एन अ बटन ब्लू बटन ओवर देयर सो फ्रॉम देयर यू कैन डाउनलोड दैट यू कैन डाउनलोड दैट नोट्स रिलेटेड टू दिस वीडियो सो वन सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द वीडियो वंस यू क्लिकड ओवर देयर वीडियो इज स्टार्टेड हेलो Welcome to this lecture. I can uh, object oriented programming. I can adjust the, uh, the sound Dhen over Kumar, here. Assistant professor, just, uh, adjust the sound. I can mute also. I can play and pause also. I can adjust the quality of the videos also, like 220 auto. I can play this with the best thing. I can play this video in PIP mode. I have played this video in PIP mode, and I am walking over on other tabs also, and I can see the video just like YouTube. Uh, मैं कहीं और भी काम कर रहा हूं मान लीजिए uh, मैं इस पे हूं uh, मैं के, uh, दिस एक वेबसाइट पे हूं लेकिन मैं साथ साथ में वीडियो भी देख रहा हूं तो इससे uh, जो मेरा है काम रुक नहीं रहा है सो मींस आई जस्ट आई वांट टू टेल दैट पीआईपी मोड इज आल्सो देयर इट्स वेरी वैल्यूएबल फॉर द स्टूडेंट्स यू कैन सी द वीडियो एंड पैरेलली वर्क ऑन अदर टैब्स आल्सो सो फॉर मींस गोइंग बैक टू द नॉर्मल फॉर्म यू कैन जस्ट क्लिक एंड ओवर एंड यू put up to the normal form you can also go for the